Hi guys, you're back here with Barry. Uh, summer's kicking in in Cabrera, and I'm just going to put away all the rest of my equipment here while I talk to you. And the reason why I'm out here today in Naranjito, one of my favorite little towns, little areas of Cabrera, is the fact that uh, they're beginning the paving. And for you guys that have been on the DR Escapes channel for any length of time now, and for quite a few of you who have visited me, you know uh, for almost two years now, I've been telling you to keep this in the back of your mind. And um, that this is one of the new roads slated for pavement. Um, now, I wouldn't expect you to know, but I could already tell how much grading's been done on this road. We're going to go across it together and uh, spend a little time with you. You would naturally expect all the people that have invested in this area that uh, it's a positive move in that direction in terms of land values, in terms of access, easeability, general uh, just a better you know quality of life in this area this road's always been a, a rock road so it's not like it ever really got mudded out or anything like that but the thing is the uh, this is going to be for the most part a widened double lane asphalt so uh, keep that into the back of your mind I'm gonna continue on down just on the areas um, so in other words from the main highway or la carretera is going to be all asphalted coming into Naranjito and coming back out of the exit from Naranjito which leads you into Loma Alta which many of you who've come down to visit us well you probably know both Naranjito and Loma Alta so I'm just taking it easy here, doing a slow ride, and I'm showing you all this is going to be paved. Now, old Barry has mixed emotions about it. I'm a 4x4 four four nut, but uh, for all the homes and the investments, and in generally for the whole community of Naranjito, a better quality of life, yeah, I, I have to admit, I couldn't be happier for it. It's a long time in coming, but just as we let our subscribers know over a year in advance about the Loma Alta Road, which a lot of uh, our visitors did end up purchasing in that area, properties for future building. Uh, we've been saying Loma Alta was going to build up, and a lot of you shed a sense of doubt about it, you know, six months after purchasing and nothing's happened, and we just said, hang on, hang on. Because we know when the when the project is signed and approved by President Danilo, there is somebody in that business that will tell us and let us know well in advance. And about three months after that, the local gossip starts coming into effect. But lo and behold, I've filmed Loma Alta several times. And had a couple of positive remarks about that, like we loved it anyway, but by gosh, you did say it, wouldn't it? And look what happened to Loma Alta. Well, the people that bought in uh, Montagne and Mar, uh, a lot of them uh, wanted to, or not a lot, but a couple wanted to do it for investment purposes and stuff and a reallocation of money out of their home country. They're already up about 25% in two years. So, and they're selling. So I'm gonna, switch off that topic uh, all of you who are watching this video can obviously see that uh, work is commencing okay they're widening this road unfortunately they do have to cut down some trees with progress uh, like anything is always a double-edged sword it's a, a, a you know a duality so to speak so there are some beautiful trees that are going to get cut down but for the greater part this is going to help the entire community and wanted to get this up on film as quick as possible 
I don't even know how much editing we're going to end up doing on this. I do want to make it public on our website as, as quick as possible. You can see where they're trenching up the tubing and the piping and what have you. And it's, it's kind of exciting. So um, for all you good folks that did kind of listen to us in this area as well, congratulations. Happy. It's going to be just beautiful. Where I'm going now, even though this looks or appears like I'm in the middle of nowhere, I'm actually about a um, two-minute drive to downtown Cabrera from where we're at. So it's, uh, gosh, it's, it, it's very exciting to see Cabrera on the uprise like we're seeing. And I don't know what much else I could say about this. It's, uh, it's definitely a step in the right direction. And I'm going to follow this through back until, back until the main road, and you'll see what I mean, okay? So many of you watching this are going to recognize where I am. Many of you are going to look at it, and oh my God, what a difference. And yes, you're right, okay? So I'm going over what used to be one of the very, 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 well, almost four by four spots. You did need to come up it, not down. I'm going down now. But to come up it, you would have needed a four by four if it was wet. There is no question about that. So I could see how all this has been graded down much flatter. And it's all coming into picture. So there's a lot of activity going on here. There's a lot of excitement from the people in this area. And I couldn't be happier for everybody that's planning on living in this area. It really makes me happy to see. It really makes me happy to see. Okay, as many of you all know, somebody taking pictures here. And we are now going down the road into Cabrera. So I'm doing one of what is going to be two sweeps of just some of the panoramic views that extend from Naranjito. You're going to see right now the town of Cabrera coming into picture. So when you see, um, when I mentioned earlier, um, it's maybe uh, 150 yards up the road, when I said you wouldn't believe it, but you're about two minutes to Cabrera, I was not really uh, joking when I said that, okay? I'm going to do one more sweep from another property that I have for sale. Okay, I'm up doing the second panoramic of netting Hito, which will be included in this video. This is uh, one of my favorite views in this particular area. I'm standing on the base, dead center of a great little property I have for sale. And I just wanted to go on it just to give you the idea of what many of the best views look like from Naranjito and we'll include this along with the rest of the video but it's something that spans quite a bit over a 180 degree view I have to shift so excuse me if I jitter the camera and gives you an idea of why I know Naranjito is going to be a great place for many people to be calling home. 
There's only a few of these views left, and unfortunately most of them are bigger properties, but we are working on it. So I hope this keeps you guys more up to date. Every time something new around Cabrera happens, old Barry's going to fill you in about it. And until next time, this is Barry in VR. Bye.